Good afternoon, everybody. Colin here with TechOut. Today we're going to be doing a hard drive reinstall on this HP laptop. This is the same one that I did the SSD upgrade on, um, but I've since upgraded this laptop to a Dell, the one I unboxed uh, a while ago. Friend has bought this one off me, um, so I'm just installing the one terabyte Western Digital Blue Drive that came in the Dell that I unboxed um, because I switched the SSD from this one to the Dell so I could keep that SSD. Um, so we are just going to reinstall everything back like it was. Um, so the hard drive adapter is back in there. So we're just going to screw the drive back down in there nice and secure. That one goes in last. Go ahead and put the cover back on. That should go on. It's been a minute since I took this one apart, so I'm trying to remember what order everything goes back in. There we go. Put the cover back on. Snap everything down. laptop wasn't a bad laptop for the 300 or so dollars I paid for it. Just wanted to upgrade something that I could actually um, edit with. You know, if I wanted to take the computer somewhere and go instead of using my desktop. So I got something with a more powerful i7 um, instead of the i3 that this one had. This one's got 6 gigs of RAM. So again, not a bad computer, oops, I put that hard drive screw in too soon. We're just going to leave it like that. That goes back in after the disk drive. Need to find the battery for it. Model of this laptop, it's an HP 15 AY009DX. Um, it's a touch screen. screws back in. Let's see. I think that one also goes back in after the disk drive. Which I also have to grab. It looks like the camera is going to die, so I'm going to have to switch batteries here when I go to get the disk drive. So let me get all these screws put back in, and then we will come back um, when it's time to boot it up and test everything out again. Okay, so replaced the camera battery, found the laptop battery disk drive, I inserted all those. It has a charge, that is good. I'm gonna move around to the other side here.
computer is a little bit dirty. It's been sitting for a little bit. So we're going to go ahead and let this boot up, um, and then we'll come back here in a second. Okay, so it is, um, it's booting up still. This hard drive did have Windows pre-installed from the Dell, so I don't know, there may be something um, on the drive from that computer driver specific. Um, so it's just trying to figure all that kind of stuff out right now. Uh, once it's booted up, I will come back. Um, like I said, sold it to a friend, so I'm not going to set it up. Um, I'm just making sure everything starts up properly and that everything is there. And so I'm just going to do a basic setup, box it up, and it's going to be sent off to him. So this one does have the Cortana setup uh, pre-installed, so I guess we'll use that. Your region is set to the United States. Okay. Your keyboard is set to U.S. Do you also type with another keyboard layout? Next up, the legal stuff. I'm going to go ahead and connect to the Wi-Fi real quick. So the Wi-Fi is connected. Alright, you're connected. Now, we'll check for any updates. Found some. Hang tight while we get them installed. Yay. So that's that. Um, it's pretty much set up. We're using the Cortana setup. Everything's working. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get the power cord because it's going to do some updates. I'm just going to get the basic desktop set up, and that's going to be that. This has been Colin with Tech Out, setting up this HP, uh, doing a hard drive install in it. Leave your device on, please. We're going as fast as we can. Promise. Okay, Cortana, thank you. Um, so it's all set up. It's going to be set up, ready to go. This has been Colin with Tech Out. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and have a great day. Okay.